Wolf Armor and Armadillos have been added into Minecraft. How do you get this wonderful new item? Well, Wolf Armor starts with the humble Armadillo. I am from Texas and I've seen Armadillos quite a lot, lots of times on the side of the road. <laughs> These little guys can be found in the savanna and what you're looking for from them is called a scoot. And yes, we already have had turtle scoots. They have actually been renamed because they were just scoots before. Now they are turtle scoots and we now have armadillo scoots. Now they will periodically just fall off of the armadillo. Kind of like how like a chicken lays an egg every once in a while in the game. Um, now the armadillos will also like freak out if you like start running uh, by them. So like right now I'm like sprinting and as you can see it's like bundled into a ball. So you want to avoid you know having it do that, do that all as uh, although it is very very adorable. Uh, let's see. I've seen some other armadillos around here. Let's see. Have you dropped a, Have you dropped a scoot? No, it doesn't look like. It seems like even sprinting in the air scares them. So let me slow down here. Hi, I'm no longer sprinting in the air. Y'all cool? Okay, good. Oh, oh, I did it by accident. Now, if you are impatient like I am, you can craft a brush. Very, very simple to do. Stick, copper, and a feather, and that gives you a brush. I'm gonna give myself a whole bunch of them. <laughs> with the brush, you can go up to an armadillo and just smack him with it, and it produces a scoot. Now, I'm in creative mode. If I was to be in normal survival mode, you'll see that the brush, its durability is like taken out. One, two, three, four, and my brush is broke. So if I like just spam getting scoots, I'm gonna break the brush like uber fast. This brush method will work with a dispenser. So if we put an armadillo here, take a thing. Well, there we go. You can see instead of like squirting out the brush, it actually brushed the armadillo and produced a scoot. This is very, very similar to how shears work with sheep. You can put a shear in a dispenser and it'll shear the sheep too. So we can set up a situation where we have one armadillo, a dispenser, and a ton of brushes that you've already made because brushes really aren't that resource heavy. They just don't stack. And so we can set up a situation where we just have tons of brushes and then we just go crazy spamming this as fast as possible. You can set this up on a clock and then that will produce tons of scoot for us. And it doesn't really matter that it, we only get like four out of the, the brushes because like four times nine, that's 36. I went to elementary school. Now that we have the scoot, we can actually get to making the horse armor horse armor wolf armor that is what we're making and it's gonna look a little bit like a chair that's what i think it looks like it looks like or an h maybe an h anyway you're gonna leave these top two empty and this bottom middle one empty and that gives you the wolf armor next you just need a wolf luckily i'm in creative mode so i can just spawn one in come back here eat this bone and you're gonna enjoy it okay now that we have a tamed dog or wolf Smack that boy with uh, your armor, and th that's what he looks like. Check him out. Get back here, okay? You have to model the armor. There he is. I like how he has, like, knee pads. I don't know why that kills me, but the dog looking like it has knee pads strapped to its knees, it's j it just sends me. I don't understand why. Now, my first thought when I saw this armor was that it resembles leather armor. Like, so, so much that looks like leather armor. And I forgot to turn of time okay that is better uh so because it resembles leather armor my first thought was like this has to be able to be dyed right well new no. at the moment i'm dying the dog's collar um and uh it would be that would be i think the coolest thing ever is if you could take this off by the way if you do want to unequip the armor from your dog you have to use shears there you go, and then that is how you get the armor back. But just like with leather armor, here, let me snag some leather armor, actually, uh, is uh, you can use it in a crafting table. So you throw, you know, the thing in there, you throw the dye in there, and now instead of a normal leather armor, you have dyed armor. That would be the coolest thing if we could do the same thing 
with wolf armor. And that would also, you know, there's only one type of wolf. Like you get a whole bunch of different type or one type of dog. There's a whole bunch of different types of cats, right? Many different varieties of cats. Only one dog, okay? The dog needs some love here. And uh, being able to di differentiate your dog is actually kind of hard, except for this collar. But as you can see, the collar texture isn't always facing towards you. So if the wolf armor could be dyed, that would really help to tell these animals apart. And don't forget, you can always just like use a name tag and then you'll be able to see what animal is what. This armor does provide 11 armor points of damage reduction uh that's all a complicated like algorithm to figure out uh, how much damage is taken like if it explodes like within a block or two blocks or if there's a block in the middle anyway uh all that basically means that this is the same armor protection that you would get with diamond horse armor so it's already kind of like at its peak there is some good news is that uh i mean i don't know why i said there's some good news it's not like there was bad news to begin with but anyway uh there's no durability on this armor so uh if your dog takes damage remember you can always feed your dog either rotten flesh or some type of like meat thing so like a beef um and that will uh raise its health you can tell the health of a dog based off of its tail so if i like smack this dog a few times its tail will actually start to go down this is the saddest thing i've ever done in a video please don't unsubscribe but as you can see now that he's sitting down his tail is pointed towards the ground and rotten flesh i need to get a, i need to look at your tail as i feed you boop oh come on here we go and eh Eh, there we go. Oh, oh, now he's standing up. Anyway, his tail is now pointed back up towards the sky. So uh, the durability, whenever uh, the dog takes damage, the durability of the armor will not go down. And so you can constantly feed your dog as long as it doesn't die, um, which is fantastic. Now, the armor can be enchanted. Boop. And uh, you can see I have a protection four right here. I'm not actually sure if this translates into actually protecting your dog more. I'm gonna try this. Yeah, oh, oh, that was, oh, that was so fast. Okay, that one has been enchanted. Oh, see, like I wish that the enchantment showed. Why is there no enchantment thingy? Okay, so the red one has the enchanted. The orange one is not enchanted. I can no longer say no animals were harmed in the making of this video because two of them about to get boom boomed oh uh, they both died <laughs> that was a bad experiment okay we're trying this again we're giving them the uh, actually i'm giving them no extra space i don't know what i'm thinking here i don't know why i did this this way but anyway this is uh unenchanted that one is enchanted oh no the tnt went towards the enchanted one they're just both gonna die aren't they okay yeah they died again uh one thing is when your wolf dies it will drop the armor so you can see the armor is there on the ground in fact i'm gonna just uh i guess clear my inventory here cleared there we go and then i uh, pick up wolf armor one where the other one go oh there it is oh oh they lost their enchantment ah i feel like that answers that question Enchanting does nothing. I think the addition of wolf armor is awesome. Of course, this is what the community voted for, wanting armadillos and wolf armor in the game. So, uh, so happy that it is here already. This is a development build that I'm recording this video on, so some things may change in the future. I hope nothing does, uh, or maybe that we actually get enchantments and die in the armor. That would be really cool. I'd have to like private this video or something. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope that you learned something from this video. If you did, please subscribe and catch future videos from me. Until next time, bye.